This was uh, a really interesting first of a kind thing that we have seen here at the championships where you had these joint mixed doubles teams with China and the U.S. playing uh, together and for never having played together before, uh, having been competitors rather than teammates, they worked together and played remarkably well. I don't know if you can hear some of the excitement taking place. We're in the awards ceremony right now taking place uh, for uh, Fan Zhendong. I don't know if you can hear it in the background, uh, but getting back to these mixed doubles teams, they did played remarkably remarkably well for just having one week of playing together. Uh, we had the team of Wang Man Yu and the U.S.'s Kanak Jia. They got knocked out in round uh, 16 of these uh, games, so they didn't make it to uh, the end here. But we had Ling Gua Yen and Lily Zhang. They made it all the way to the semifinals before losing to uh, Japan. But that was enough to make them bronze medalists. And this is the first time in 62 years that an American has won a medal at the World Championships. And that is because of the teamwork between China and the United States. Of course, this is a year that marks the 50th anniversary of ping pong diplomacy when you had the table tennis teams, China and the United States, meeting at that 1971 uh, World Games uh, in Japan. They formed a friendship. The U.S. team was invited to China, and this really paved the way uh, for the thawing of relations between China and the United States. And then by the end of that decade, you had diplomatic relations established. So this is of uh, critical significance this year, 50 years on, and forming those teams was really about uh, honoring that memory, that legacy, and the lessons that were learned. And these players just saying that they had an absolute ball playing with each other, learning from each other. Lily Zhang saying that she just felt that with every match that she and Lin were playing, that they were just getting stronger together as a team. So the significance of them playing together on this 50th uh, anniversary of ping pong diplomacy, not lost on anyone.